NASA's Glenn Research Center develops critical systems technologies and capabilities that address national priorities in partnership with U.S. industry, universities, and other government institutions. Glenn's world-class research and technology development efforts are keys to advancing exploration of our solar system and beyond, while maintaining global leadership in aeronautics. This spring, 26 undergraduate student interns took on the challenge of supporting these professional science and engineering projects at the NASA Glenn Research Center. These inspiring undergraduates converged in Cleveland, Ohio, from universities across the country, including Puerto Rico, for an intensive 15-week hands-on internship experience with the Undergraduate Student Research Program. These eager, bright minds come from a range of academic disciplines in the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics fields. This spring, we visited these remarkable individuals to find out how the experience went and where they are headed to next. I was able to just go up to anyone in any of the fields and ask them about what they do. Being given my own project. I got to use a supercomputer. Getting to learn about stuff I actually cared about and how it applies in real life. The high-powered microscope that I got to use. Exploring an entirely new field that I would never have really had the, uh, the opportunity to explore. Getting some real hands-on experience doing research. I can really see myself going back to school now. Uh, really with more motivation to uh, study harder because a lot of this stuff actually does apply. Getting to see the results of this experiment as they were done. It's a great atmosphere. Being able to apply it to something that's really going to matter. Learning how to develop a project. Uh, the networking opportunities and the publication I came out of here with. Learning to work independently and taking a project and a big problem and being able to break it up into pieces by myself. It's overwhelming just how much I've learned from being here only seven weeks so far. I feel like I could take that everywhere I go basically. Be engrossed in the engineering design process. Definitely the troubleshooting experience I've gotten is definitely a good learning experience. I loved it and the lab experience and the lab skills that I've learned. It's the knowledge that I've gained. Uh, it's something that can't be replaced. Actually seeing a real life application to the knowledge that I learned in school. The taking of, um, of a completely new topic that I never had experience for, working from the ground up, uh, learning something completely new, um, and being able to uh, apply that and have uh, definable results. I have an internship out at Idaho National Lab with the Center for Space Nuclear Research. Going to grad school and I'm going to continue researching and studying the same uh, field. Well this summer I'm going to NASA Langley for the uh, NASA Aero Academy and then after that uh, grad school. And as soon as I finish my internship I'll be doing a co-op here so I definitely want to stay here at Glenn. Hopefully get a job at NASA because that's my dream goal of combining aerospace with chemical engineering. This fall I'll be taking a co-op offer here at Glenn. Got an offer for a future co-op this summer at Boeing. Uh, I've been offered a co-op uh, at Goddard. I will end up with my bachelor and master's in a dual program. Electrical engineering, master's degree in electrical. Going on to grad school to get a master's and a PhD. It's just a great experience. I'm trying to get as much work experience as possible before I graduate. I'm going to a Honda Aircraft to work for them as well and hopefully come to NASA in the future to work in their academies. I go back to Puerto Rico and finish my degree in mechanical engineer. Definitely somewhere in the mechanical engineering industry and hopefully aerospace industry. I'll actually stay at NASA and I'm now a co-op so I plan to pursue grad school and further studies uh, academic wise but I'll also continue to work with NASA Glenn.